With these outcome documents um, defined, what does it mean information society? And this is the one of the biggest success of uh, the World Summit on the Information Society. Uh, at the international level, everybody started to speak the same language, uh, having um, no confusion, but only clear understanding. Once we are talking about the e-government, or once we are talking about the e-health, or infrastructure, or, or cybersecurity, uh, we have clear definition of those uh, aspects. So, talking about the implementation, we are in fact talking about the response uh, to the uh, outcome documents, uh, which defined what has to be done uh, up to the 2015 in order to create by that date uh, the open and inclusive information society. And therefore, for us, it's so important uh, that uh, the multi-stakeholder character of this uh, event is kept and is strongly emphasized. In fact, 2015 is very particular for us um, because um, the outcome documents of the Tunis are referring to this date as uh, the final review date, when we uh, should uh, make the real review of this what we did and what we didn't succeed to achieve. And therefore, this year is very particular for us. Uh, we are taking a stock on this, what has been done so far and what we can achieve within five years. There is a several connectivity goals which we are going to review this year and based on the uh, World Telecommunication Development Report, which is analyzing and uh, taking a closer uh, look into uh, the all connectivity goals, we are taking a look what has to be still done within the missing five years. And uh, there is a lot to be done. Uh, the all villages should be connected. Uh, the all public schools uh, should be connected. And there, sh there is plenty of work to be done in the public access points uh, to the internet. Uh, so uh, there is few items uh, still uh, which need to be addressed in the appropriate way. With this forum is um, as inclusive as possible. It's organized in, uh, via uh, the three leading um, organizations um, mandated via the Tunis outcome documents. Um, the meaning ITU, UNESCO and UNDP, as well as um, it's organized in uh, cooperation with the UNCTAD, which is servicing the CSTD, uh, which uh, is responsible for the follow-up uh, of the WISIS. And therefore, uh, this is the meeting which should bring all agencies, UN agencies together um, and um, also which offers them uh, the possibility and platform uh, for uh, organizing their own facilitation meetings. Uh, and this is just the moment when all of them, they should come, discuss and also get together in order to um, get clear uh, advice and guidance uh, for the whole process. And we are seeking um, uh, to uh, receiving uh, this uh, with the meeting which will be held uh, just on the uh, 14th of May, when the all facilitators will get together and they will debate what still needs to be done in the future in order to achieve uh, the goals uh, of the 2015. And are you confident that those goals will be reached by 2015? And, and if so, what needs to happen in order for that to occur? Um, we are seeing significant progress uh, in uh, the um, development of the information society. Uh, and we are seeing also observing uh, several positive implementation projects uh, implemented on the annual basis and reported to this process. And it makes us believe uh, that it will be possible uh, to achieve uh, the goals. However, a lot of efforts has to be still uh, dedicated. And I would like to underline that this is not only the responsibility of of the facilitating organizations of the um, of uh, the process, but also the responsibilities of the all countries uh, which came in 2005 in order to agree upon uh, the all four outcome documents of the World Summit on the Information Society and committed that it will be possible to accomplish uh, these tasks which were described in the outcome documents.